Hornet CM Storm. This this mouse is probably the cheapest gaming mouse you'll probably buy. So this is this series is gonna be um, my gaming setup for 2014, 2015, and so on. So each year I'll, I'll do this. So the first look of this amazing mouse. First, you might there's three um, rests, finger rests, these two buttons, and these two buttons, and XORNET and CM Storm. That's the front. The back, we have two additional support here with the um, optical high pressure and um, position sensor and all these numbers made in China, XORNET. So let's get started. So the usage, um, the usage there's five buttons, uh, two, two fixed buttons. It's uh, it goes up to 2,000 uh, DPI, and it's only made for the right hand. And it's a gaming mouse, so you can use it as a art making, such as making circles and straight lines. It's a really uh, comfortable in the hand. And um, yeah. These two are left click, right click, scroll. This is the uh, sensitivity tilt. So if you, d if you, there's, there's three levels. So the top level, which goes all the way up, which means there's a high sensitivity. So even if you do this, it'll go all the way across. This is good for FPS games, uh, as an assault rifle, and um, you can, you know, have quick reactions. Do the, there's another level, right? This is the medium level. Medium level is for just browsing the internet. Or you can use the high level as browsing the internet. That's what I use, cause I I don't, I don't I don't like to move my mouse that much. So yeah, and then the lowest level what I use is for snipers. So I scope in and then like I get the straight good headshot and click this button and it works all the time. And this is also and the lowest level can be used for making smooth lines in art, Photoshop. So um, my personal review. I've been having this for about four months now, and it has not worn out. I like this gaming. I like this mouse, even though it's only thirty dollars. It's really good. I would give it uh, four point five stars because it's not very well built. Because um, because if, if as you can see, I have my hand here. Well, this can be used as a palm, the 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 hook thing, or this thing. If you guys have smaller hands, you can use this. This is comfortable, but there's some disadvantage. This is this mouse is made for holding it like this. So if you like holding it like this, get this mouse. It's better than the Razer Naga. So if you're holding it like this, you can see there's some space between the scroll and here. So the reaction time, there's a lot. There's it's too big. If you do this, if you have it hold it like this, you can you can just go here. But there's a lot of space between here and here. And also. And if you do this, there's a lot, a lot, there's like like three centimeters gap between the sensitivity changes. So sensitivity changes are very unreliable. Although what I like about this thing is um, that there's this ring um, ring finger stand and these two buttons. These two buttons enable enable me to switch my weapons or uh, switch my slots in Minecraft or do other options. I use this software called Xmouse. I'll show you guys on the desktop recorder. So yeah, um, this is my mouse for 2014. I don't know if I'm going to get a um, 2015 new mouse or I'll keep the same because I actually really like this. I don't know. So um, yeah. That, this is the review of CMX Storm XORNET. Bye.